Hello everyone. Good morning. Sunday morning. Coming to you live from McCash Manor. Well, it's not going to be live when you see it. <clears throat> this may be one of the last two or three videos actually because we put our house up for sale and we don't know where we're going to go yet. So, let's start a different loc at a different location. <clears throat> so about 2 weeks ago, we planted mammoth sunflowers. That's this row right here. Just to provide a little bit more shade for the basil and the light sensitive crops over here in this long bed. We have watermelon that are coming up. We have uh, some cilantro that is uh, taken off. It's bolted, but we've got another bed of cilantro coming up next to it. We have our herbs. Sorry for the light to dark transition. Oregano, sage, thyme, catnip. <laughs> Basil, hyssop, lemon balm. We have uh, some bell peppers in here, some jalapenos in here. There's our lemon tree. Our baby pine tree we've grown from seed. It's going with us. Oh, it's going with us. It's going with us, or it's going to be taken care of by somebody till we get situated. Our basil over here has uh, flowered. We've got a new crop of uh, radishes coming up. I have no idea why the radishes only want to grow on that high side, not this low side. We have cantaloupe. It's coming up. What's left of our onions and garlic, we've been pulling them and curing them. zucchini plants are doing amazing we can't keep up eating them so we're handing them out to our neighbors oh here you go oh this one got it looks like I didn't see it in time <laughs> a little big Some of our pea pods are ripe for the picking. We've got quite a few. They did really well. I didn't think they would do well with this heat, but they did really well. We've got some beans still coming up. The mint likes the post and the water that drips from it all the time. Bear, out, out. Corn's doing well. We've got some ears. It hasn't been uh, the time for pollinating on bees, this one is over. On the Spaghetti squash is doing amazing. Oh, we've got a summer squash here that's ready to get picked up. This one got away from I didn't see this one either. <laughs> Cucumbers have been killing it. I've already made one quart of uh, pickled spring cucumbers, what I like to call them spring. They're not full dill and they're not full sugar. They're a nice blend in the middle. Nice and crisp. Oh, we've got more zucchini that I missed. Oh, wow. Got a couple.
we're smoking some veggies today. Yeah, that would sounds like a good idea. These are wonderful. Olive oil, salt and pepper, and put them on a smoker. Delicious. Yeah, the blackberry is just... We're distracted this year. I'm not sure what the deal is. They're delicious, though. Bear, my German Shepherd, loves these. I've got to keep him out of the garden, otherwise he'll eat them. Strawberries are going to town. There might be one or two for Lila today. Yeah, Lila. My granddaughter will come in here and raid this. Let's look at the tomatoes are going to be nuts. Shout out to LaConnor Garden. We don't know what they are, but we're excited to try them. We've been very fortunate too. We're not getting the horned worms. Uh, my son's garden, they have them already and they're looking for them daily. But we have none. So uh, we have a lot of lizards. We have a lot of lizards, which is good. I don't know if they're climbing these bushes. Looking for horned worms, but here you go, bear. Like, thank you, Dad. Molly and Polly are probably staying with the house. It is Molly and Polly, right? Yep. Our cherry tomatoes over here are hanging on. Now that we cut the rye grass down, the, the squash and the cherry tomatoes can get more sun, so. Hopefully they should take off here in a little bit. Our herbivores, our carnivores slash herbivores. We got hit with a massive windstorm yesterday and I've got so much debris in the pool. Wisteria is doing wonderful. We planted some beans in there. Look at the trumpet. It bloomed. It, it bloomed. Hummingbirds are gonna be hitting on this thing hardcore. We've got quite a quite a bundle of blooms and more to come. And here's our hot lips. This is its second blooming, so I'm probably gonna trim it back, whack it, and uh, let it encourage it to bloom again. So coming to you from McCash Manor, Garrett and LA, God bless, have a good day.